We are live down here in Chicago, the home of the Chicago Bulls and the Chicago Blackhawks for tonight's obituary. The gun, you are under arrest. Got us into this parking lot, pal. Have a Miss Piggy? Pants and burgers. Yeah. Lots of space in this car. Got hall. done doing the grave of one of the Blues brothers, John Belishi, here in Chicago. So I hope you enjoyed tonight's video where he played in a couple movies, especially the well known Blues brothers, along with Aretha Franklin. Ray Charles, James Brown, and I forgot the woman's name from Star Wars. So I hope you enjoyed tonight's video. I believe he died from drugs. I'm not positive. So when I read the obituary, I'll make it clear. I hope you uh, enjoy the video. Elmwood Cemetery for tonight's grave. And they are open right there. Ron, wide open, the shot, he scores! Okay, so anyway, this looks like a pretty, like, swamp cemetery per se. We are down here in Chicago, Illinois, for the grave of John Adam Belishi. His birthday is January 24th, 1949, Chicago, Illinois. His death date, March 5th, 1982, at the age of 33, Hollywood, Los Angeles County, California. We are live down here at the Elm Wood Cemetery and Mausoleum in River Grove, Cook County, Illinois. He was an actor, a comedian, a musician when he was born in Chicago, Illinois uh, as a boy his family moved to Whedon where uh, John played on the high school football team and he was also the homecoming king later on he attended the University of Wisconsin where he started founding and acting Trump he then auditioned for a spot with Chicago's famous second city Comedy Club. Now later on he moved to New York City and he landed a role with Broadway at the National Lapoon's Lemmings where it led to a job as a writer and a syndicated National Lapoon's Radio Hour. Well of course uh, he started his television career. The biggest thing he did was he played in a Blues Brothers movie along with Aretha Franklin, Ray Charles, and some other celebrities. I guess John uh, was considered a hardcore party man where most of his adult life he did heroin and cocaine and sometimes he mixed it with a uh, cocktail. It's called a speedball. Unfortunately an overdose of these chemicals uh, cocaine I believe it was heroin led to his death that was a fatal respiratory failure I guess there was a woman by the name of Kathy Smith that uh, I guess she was from Canada gave him the fatal dose of the drugs and she admitted objecting him with these drugs that led to her arrest she was extradited from Canada to face these charges she was originally charged with first degree murder and unfortunately later on with much delayed by her lawyers she took a plea bargain that reduced her charge to involuntary manslaughter and she served 15 months in prison for his death and there he is 
First saw, that's the parents of, I believe, Mr. John Belishi. Father and mother, I believe, in 1949, she died in 1980. Then, as we turn around here, there he is, right there. John Belishi, died in 1982. Born 1949. He gave us laughter. Nope, I'm sorry, I messed up. I uh, imagine that might be his grandparents right there. Father, Adam, 1986. Mother, Agnes, 1989. There he is. Blues Brothers. So, uh, that's just something else. And you see, in the cemetery, it's very well uh, packed, per se, in Chicago. Regardless, it's a beautiful day. So we're going to let the dogs do their business here. Come here, guys. All right, let's get going, guys. Turn left, then turn left. I hope you enjoy tonight's film feature. Please make sure and check out my other videos. Have a great day.